Quick pass ahead by Farrell. Here's Caron dropping it off right side. Salandra high slot here. Costas back for Salandra. He scores. What a terrific passing play. Michael Salandra for Jackson here. Costas back for Salandra on the right wing side. And the Warrior forward has goal number 20 on the season and has given West Kelowna a 1 0 lead. Nice pass ahead by Jack Farrell to work it for Caron. And look at this passing play. Salandra on the right side for Kirkostas in the middle. Back for Salandra on the right wing, and he throws it home. So it'll be Salandra on the goal. Kirkostas and Caron will draw the assists on the marker. And the Warriors take a 1 0 lead. And it's Salandra who's going to take the penalty shot. Warriors second penalty shot this year. They're 0 for 1. Salandra ahead looking for his second goal of the game. Slowly down the left wing side. Cuts to the middle to the backhand. Scores! What hands. What a goal. Michael Salandra makes it 2-0. Salandra with a forehand fake to the backhand. Past Pulver. Goal number 21 is second goal of the period for the Warriors forward and West Kelowna jumps ahead two to nothing. Mackey in the corner, tied up there by Trey Osmus. Puck is still being battled for there in the right wing corner. As it comes free now for Trent Wilson, he'll just pry it up against the boards too. That was 20 seconds of board battle, but it comes back along right side and a quick shot they score from the right face-off circle. It's Tanner Wallos with his first BC Hockey League goal, a bullet up and over the glove side of Rorick Appleby. And the Warriors are holding the puck in the corner, engaged with the board battle, but it comes back along right side of Wallos Berries. And with 9.35 to go in the first period, Salmon Arms power play goal makes it a 2-1 hockey game. Of the game and one for one so far on the man advantage here are the Silverbacks. Drop pass at center. Worked along the left wing side, broken up by Felix Caron. He's ahead, shorthanded, down the right side. Caron to the net, he scores! Hooked to the goal, but he finds the net anyway. Felix Caron, a shorthanded goal, and it's 3-1 West Kelowna. Caron with his 25th of the year and earns his third shorthanded goal of the season. Battling through a stick check. Fought through the hook and made his way to the net and worked around the boards in the right wing. Here's JJ Montero back for Broberg. Left wing side, Casey Leyland will control back for Broberg. A shot tipped in front, they score. Reed Varconi at the front of the net gets the shorthanded goal back. He buries on the power play and the scoring continues in this opening period as the Silverbacks make it 3 2. Varconi's ninth of the year. As he finds the, as Varconi found that puck that was loose at the front of the net and was able to beat his man there. So Varconi gets the marker and now back the other way. The Warriors score. Cal Hughes, it's 4 2. Right off the faceoff, Hughes takes the puck in the left circle and beats Pulver up and over the glove side. And just moments after Sam and R makes it a 3-2 game, the Warriors jump back ahead 4-2. Towards right side, Nordstrom lays his body into a man, but Sam and R will get to it and get up ice on the right wing side. It's Cooksey with speed, works to the front of the net, he scores! Cole Cooksey gets around the Warrior defense and makes his way in down the right side, cuts in front and beats Rourke Appleby to the blocker side at Salmon Arm, has made it a one goal game once more, it's 4-3. A 2-1 score, the Beast came back and scored a late goal then scored the overtime winner. So we'll see what tomorrow night has in store for us, but we'll see what the rest of this game has in store as well. Isaiah Norland to the front of the net, tipped in, scores! Owen Drury! Right at the front of the net, Looks like he directed that home. Drury's got his first goal since September 23rd, and the Warriors take a 5-3 lead. Norland put it to the front of the net, 
And I don't know if that actually went off of Drury. It might have gone off the Silverback stick and into the back of the net as Norland puts it on. And I think it did. I think it's going to be Isaiah Norland's goal. Worked it ahead on the right wing, looking to try and find his man there. And Martin, that was broken up as Ash tried to center it back in front, pushed back to the blue line. Allen along, shot, he scores through traffic. Tristan Allen finds its way past Rorick Appleby on the glove side. And after over 10 minutes of continuous non-stop action, Tristan Allen finds the back of the goal with 2.54 to go in the third. It's 5-4. Allen gets the goal. A scrum for below the goal line. Wilson trying to find it as well. 13 seconds to play. They continue to battle for it. Allen knocked down. Puck comes loose. Centering pass to the side of the net. Push just wide. Five seconds to go. Wallace a quick shot. That was blocked. Nordstrom gathers. The clock will wind down. This one's over. The Warriors win. A four goal first period highlights win number 25 on the season for West Kelowna. They win five of the six games in the season series against Salmon Arm and knock off the Silverbacks in regulation at home tonight, 5-4 the final.